hello friends hope you are all doing well in this video we are going to create the program for taking user input so we will understand the concept of user input in java in this lecture this lecture will be a practical based lecture there will be no theoretical concept first thing you just have to create a project so you have to go and click this button for creating a new project Click the Java with ANT and automatically it will select the Java application. You just have to click next and give the name of this program. So I can just write here as lecture user input, right? Now when I just press the finish button, so it will create a project and this is the main method first thing first the essential thing that is very important in this lecture we have to follow the step the first thing is very important here is to import the scanner class because the scanner class is the built-in class created by java to take user input so whenever you just have to import any class so you just have to write import a statement for that purpose now write import right here and after that give a space write java dot util dot scanner a scanner is the name of class through this line you can easily just import the scanner class what is the second thing after just importing the class you have to create the object for that class it is a practices from object oriented programming so when we will go into the oops concept so I will also explain that later in that lecture so for now you just have to understand that whenever you just import any class so you need to create an object for that class as well now we have as we have imported the scanner class so we have to create the scanner object so we have just write a scanner right here and we are going to give the object name you can give any name right here you can write sc abc whatever you want to write you can write here but i am just going to give obj right here the scanner obj is equals to new and after that you have to write a scanner again like this now for the system dot end inside the parameter all right after that our agenda is to take a user input so first we have to give the comment or or a comment statement right well, printing a statement should be right here so for that you have to give the sound system order print ln inside that you have to write enter any number and when you just write the enter any number you have to obviously take the first data type and create a variable the variable is x and this variable will take the user input how can you take the user input for that purpose you have to write obj dot next and i and t should be in this format so just save the program run the file and it will ask you for any number when i just write 55 so it has been taken it as an input so now the number is going to be put as input right but we have to print right here after taking the input as well so you have to give the system order print ln inside that um, we can write output is the concatenating sign of plus and after that put x right here again run the file it will ask you enter any number after that write 77 and the output is 77 so this is how simply you can take the user input so this is the way to take an input and integer but now let me tell you how can you take the double floating point input right so double y is equals to obj dot next after that you can write double right here And just put the statement enter any decimal value. Just save the program, put the final statement output decimal, and after that, concatenate that variable. Save the program, run the file.
so when it will just run the file the output will be somehow like this it will ask you the integer input i just gave 88 so the output is 88 it is now asking me about the decimal value so i just have written here as 98.222 when i just press enter it has just print the output of decimal as well so this is how simply you can take the user input in java hopefully you understand that so if you like this video please hit the like button and subscribe this channel and must follow us on instagram